and welcome back to another YouTube video. Today it will not be a vlog or anything like that, but your girl will be finally coloring my hair. Okay, coloring. We're gonna do some hair coloring. <sighs> like my hair has been bleached literally for the past two, three weeks, and it's time to. It's time, it's time to make it do what it do, okay? It's time to make it do what it do. So, I'll be using the Flat Rebellious Colors in the um, color Midnight Magenta. It's the No Bleach Kit. I did use their uh, actual blonde bleach kit on my head and enlighten it to this color because my hair was red. So, I'm using the Splat brand. Um, let's see what's up in here. Cause it's been so long since I've used this brand. Um, I'm normally using the Kiss Temptation colors, um, but for some strange reason, Rips has not been my best friend lately. Like it lasts for like a couple days and then it like fades out or whatever. So yeah, so it came with a big bottle of dye already mixed and everything. It comes with a deep construction, deep reconstructor. Um, so I'm assuming it's like a conditioner because you put it on after you shampoo. And then, of course, you got your directions and gloves. So we're going to snatch these off, put them on, and we'll be right back. Okay, so. If you are a beginner with dyeing your hair, make sure you read your directions, make sure you do your strand tests and all that. Just make sure that you're not allergic to anything because you don't want to just go in full blown into it and be allergic to it and then your scalp just swell up, face swell up, breaking out and all that different stuff. So make sure you read the um, your instructions and all that before you use it, especially if you have never done this before. Um, but yeah, so I'm about to pop this color. Oh, hot. Well, take that off and we're just gonna go all in okay so as you can see I am shortcut <laughs> so I'm just gonna start just spreading this all over <laughs> And I would say be sure to put like an oil or a grease or something on your um, hairline around the edges. That way um, your hairline doesn't get stained or anything like that. But me, I'm going to go all up in it and all that good stuff. So, so I got it all over. Let me turn. reason why I decided to do this color is because my website, yes, I am I am an owner of my own lip gloss line, including lashes and all that different stuff. I have my website that I'm working on right now. I currently shut it down so I can get some stuff together, you know, bring it together, new pictures, new templates, and all that good stuff. So, um... Yeah, my colors for my website is pink. <laughs> yes, pink. And yes, I'm a Barb. I'm a Barb. I am a Nikki fan, okay? So, it's going to be like Pink Friday up on my website when it finally, you know, come finally when I finally reopen it, you know? So, I just wanted to do the pink hair and all that good stuff and so, but this is what it's looking like and I'm loving it I really am so far I can't wait to see the final results after I you know get it together but um, I'm gonna let this sit on my hair for about 25 to 35 minutes and then I'll be back alright y'all so it's been well over 35 minutes since I've um, had this stuff on my head so I'm gonna go wash it out and I'll be back with the final results. And yeah, 
let y'all see what it looks like. I'm also gonna beat my face. So now I'm just adding the deep reconstructor. I'm using like the whole packet really. Just adding this all over. And I gotta let this sit for about 20 minutes and then I'm gonna wash it out. And we'll be back with the final look. Alright y'all, so now I'm about to style it, jelly down, sleek it down, whatever you want to call it. Um, I use three things only when it comes to styling my short hair. So I use the Via Natural Ultra Care Coconut Oil. oil. It uh, promotes stronger, shinier, and healthier hair moisturizes the skin, cuticles, and nails. So you can use it on scalp and body. I use the Gots to Be. It's an OG. It's definitely an OG. I use this to hold down my edges. And I use the Cantu She Butter Flexible Hold Anti-Shedding Styling Gel with Honey. It's um, actually, I guess, the new look of it or whatever. I use this to actually slick down my hair because I don't like for my hair to be like super super hard. But I don't mind my edges because I need my edges to, you know, because I sweat around that area. So now I'm about to show y'all how I do it. to make sure I can get, get all that oil to my scalp and through every bits and pieces of hair. So I'm basically, basically brushing my hair in the direction I want to lay it. So now you can see I've already parted my hair in the direction I want it to lay so now I'm just gonna take this little brush part it some more and I'm going to add gel quite a bit and I'm just gonna start gelling it out <laughs> completely 100% sleek because I don't have a perm on anything. My hair is still natural for you. I'm going to start on this side. Put a little bit of guts to bite. <laughs>
just for a little extra security, I'm gonna spray my hair with this got to be um blast and freeze spray. Pretty sure a lot of y'all are um, familiar with that. But y'all check these edges out. Okay, so now I'm about to tie the hair down and I like All right, y'all, that's the end of the video. This is the after look. Let me know in the comment section below what you think of this look and what you would like to see next. So if you're feeling this, give me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. And I will see y'all in my next video. Until then, peace, love. Bye.